Hey all brothers and sisters, my name is Captain Meatshield and welcome back to Slime Rancher. So I've been spending a little bit of time off camera just getting some money together, chucking a few more plots over into the refinery. Um, I'm thinking of going and opening up the docks now that we've got enough money to do that. So let's head over that way and uh, go and do that. I'm also thinking of uh, maybe trying to track down some more of those Gordos. Um, I don't know where the rest of them are going to be, but let's see what the docks have to offer. A rubber ducky. Oh, okay. Right, that's a toy for something. It's a type, slime toy. Do it. Oh, okay. I'll have to figure out who wants that then. Uh, that's probably going to be the puddle slimes, to be honest, isn't it? Um, hmm. Doesn't seem to be too much out here. Another of these uh, little messages from H. A view of the sea really reminds you of our greater purpose, Beatrix. The sea was the first great unknown, and then space, and then whatever is beyond all that. That need to see what's around the next corner is in my bones, and since you're out here, I reckon it's in yours too. Though I suppose you could also be out here because you like the fresh air, or you prefer the untamed beauty of this land. Or maybe it's because you're looking to leave something far behind you. Sure is the way to do it. It doesn't get much further than this. I suppose it doesn't, does it? Hmm. There's a very, very nice and soothing little waterfall up there. Have we got anything of interest around this way? Is jetpack going to let me up anywhere? Oh, come on, up we go. Oh god, right. Ooh, hello. There's something up here. Yeah, there's another tabby gordo over that way. Uh, there doesn't seem to be anything of uh, particular interest around this way. Sploosh! <laughs> right, let's take uh, the rubber ducky back with us. I want to figure out who wants this. I'm going to go and check the Slimepedia, see if it'll give me uh, any information on that. Right. <laughs> Wonderful. Alright, this doesn't give me any information on what toys they like. Does it come under resources, maybe? No, it's not going to come under that. This seems like the th sort of thing the puddle slimes would like. Especially considering the whole water thing, so... You, you guys can... Have I think they like it. <laughs> okay, you guys have fun with that. I also just remembered this whole 7Z club thing. Alright, the Roostro weather vane. Let's let's spend a little bit of cash in, in doing this. Fence upgrade. Path upgrade. Porch upgrade. I can't afford that. Okay, we've we've done enough for now. Um what it Oh, I see the weather vane up there. Um what was the fence up? Oh! Oh, this is looking very nice! Oh god, we're gonna get this place looking so nice! Yes! <laughs> I know, right? It's gonna be brilliant! We also need to go back to do some more um, stuff for Mochi at some point. But I'm gonna see what we've got. Oh, speaking of. Um, Victor. Okay, let's do one for you. Uh, are rat slimes a natural evolution, or a result of exposure to foreign matter? I don't know. Why have you got a Game Boy strapped to your chest? Who knows? What do you need? Four crystal slimes and a puddle. Fine. I'm gonna go and grab them from the wild, because I'm not, I'm not like, trading you my own. But I know where to get them for you, so... Just give me a minute. Ooh! What are you? Come here! Come here! Can I? No. Damn it! I can open this anyway. What's a fucking golden slime? Um, slime fossils. Okay. I want to know how I get the golden slime. Is that one another one that I can't capture? Like the um the lucky slime. I have a feeling it probably is. 
Ooh. Blueprint acquired. Minty grass patch. Though this gr grass does indeed have a plant of minty aroma, the taste is actually quite bitter. Ugh. Maybe we won't be trying that. Oh god, radiation! No! Uh, right, it was four crystal slimes in a puddle, wasn't it? I hope. I hope I got those numbers correct. Um, right. You! Oh, fuck off! Oh no! I fired away one of my fossils! No, give those back. Right, there's four crystal slimes. Let's go and find ourselves a puddle. Yellow! No, nope, that's a treasure pod. There you are. You. Oh, oh, oh. Lucky slime's around somewhere. It's down there. I haven't got any meat on me. Damn it. Oh, fuck, there's chickens. They're probably all getting eaten. There's too many rad slimes around here anyway. I, I don't have the time or the patience for it. We've got other things to be doing. Whoosh! We're getting back. Right, um... Puddle slime. Crystal slime. Yeah! Give me them onions. Right, so what is the slime fossil going to be used for? Is that a resource? Slime science material, yeah. Uncommon resource obtained with a drill. I see. Okay. We'll go and chuck that into the, uh... Refinery. And... The onions can go in with the crystal slimes, I guess. What are we doing for plots over this way? Not great at the moment. But I'll just leave you guys to it, and there'll be plenty to come and pick up eventually. I'm tempted to go back to... Um, Mochi's Manor. I also want to see what we've got available in here at the moment. Tank Booster 2. I have that. Getting that power core upgrade as well. And you know what? We, we can afford the rest of the upgrades for now, so we'll just have the lot. Um, but yeah, let's go to, go to see Mochi, and we'll go and grab some Quicksilver Slimes, let everything kind of tick over here for a little while. It's nice to be able to carry like 40 things in in this tank just want to make sure that everything's got as much food as as possible so that if i'm spending a fair amount of time over at mochi's i don't have to worry about like coming back to feed everyone the one that's always being a problem at the moment is the uh the tabby booms just because the amount of chickens we get just isn't much these days but for some reason anyway um, we'll go and grab as many as we can and chuck them into the pen. Alright, I'll leave you guys to it. You just have a nice time. I'm gonna go and get some money. And most importantly, I want the deluxe chicken coop. Because I think that will really help things. We're like, not too far off being able to get it. So, let's go. Right, first off. Oh, out of my way, fellas. We'll have that energy upgrade there, and we're going to go up, and we're going to grab a slow field. Okay. No. Oh god, I'm firing out the quicksilver plots. No. Wrong, wrong thing. Damn it! I'm out of charge. Okay. I'm going to keep it moving. Keep it moving. Oh, thunderclap! Watch out, lads, I got the clap again. <laughs> ho, 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 ow, ow. Oh, damn it, we're down to my last 20 seconds. Oh, come on, give me, give me something good. Ah, damn it, there we go. A 63 on that, that's not too bad. Let's head over onto hard mode. Oh, yes, nice. Get as many of them over here as we possibly can. Tank that damage. It's worth it. It's worth every new buck. Damn it. Until you run out of bloody ammo. Ooh, give me that. Thank you. Fucking... 
Jesus. Terrible shot. I really need to learn how to be able to read, lead my shots with this. I'm not very good at it. <laughs> what are you? You're going to be another static clinger. Nope. Thunderclap. Oh, yeah. That's what I like to see. Oh, fuck. <laughs> right. I am just going to hang about here. Waste all my ammo until it's either empty or it's game over. Uh, as good it is empty. Alright. 149 in total. Not bad. Oh, I need less than 100. Damn it. How long have I got until the other one recharges? Seven minutes. Damn it. Alright, I'll go and find something else to do instead. We'll have a run around, see if the um, slimes have all dropped off a nice pile of plorts for us. Got more food to feed them as well, so we better get on that. Oh, yes, that's a nice big pile of uh, crystal plorts. I think there's some more in there. Right? Damn! You guys have just got massive piles of bloody pogo fruit lying around everywhere, because that tree just gives off far too much fucking food. Seems to be doing alright over here as well. It seems to be going very well. I do think being able to upgrade the, um, the chicken coops is going to make a big difference in keeping the boom tabbies like well fed and looked after. But yeah, let's go and cash all this stuff in. Like, they're still just eating and fighting out more stuff, and good oh god, you guys actually left me quite a few today. Is the uh, the presence of the rubber ducky making a difference? I hope it is. You guys do seem to like it. They're so fucking cute and chilled. I love them. Like, the puddle slimes are just the best. Oh, that's a nice big hefty wad of money. Started dialing down a little bit as we got towards the end, because it was all pink slimes and... or pink plorts and rock plorts, but... I kind of want to keep upgrading stuff. Porch upgrade. Wait, what? Excuse me? Well, first off, I want to see my new porch. I don't see much different, unless it's talking about this bit. Or is it the new doormat that I've had? Um, <laughs> who knows? Alright, what's uh, what's this one? Skylark 1, Chroma Station, Cobalt Chroma, Milkshake Chroma. Learn more. No idea. And then there's an arch upgrade that I can't afford. Star map, okay. Chroma packs now available. Ms. LeBeau, the Z 7Z Corporation would like to congratulate you on attaining the, the rank of Skylark 1. With this rank, you now have access to a new avenue of creative self expression Chroma packs. Chroma packs allow you to apply new color schemes to your ranch house, vac pack, and ranch tech, allowing you to stand out from all the other ranchers on the far, far range. And while we realize that most slime ranchers never even see another rancher given geographic separation between rancher properties, we have a feeling that they... we have a feeling that they know. Oh yes, they know. Please also note that by the time you have likely read this message, the 7Z Corporation has already installed a Chroma Pack terminal just outside your home. The 7Z Corporation covertly installing machines outside your home quickly and reliably. The 7Z Corporation. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> Okay, uh, let's see. Oh, that's just gone over all of my bloody ornaments here, isn't it? Uh, I think I might have lost some of those. <sighs> Bollocks. I'm going to stick them all here. Uh, right, okay, let's see what we can do here. I'm going to go with Kampeki, I think. It looks kind of... Ooh. quite like that. Um, apply that to that, and apply that to that as well. Ooh, yeah. Oh, some nice colours. I like it. <laughs> what do you need? Who's there? Ogden or Thora? We'll go with Ogden. Eating carrots helps you see in the dark. 
Does it now? Well, that's okay, but you don't even want carrots. You want pogo fruit and heartbeats. What's wrong with you, Ogden? You mad bastard. I've grown a lot of heartbeats. <laughs> Alright, you can have some more veggies in there, you hungry bastards. Give me some good plots. Damn it. We'll punch you in the face with heartbeats. We'll punch you in the face with your own food. And you guys can have the cube berries because I know the phosphor side of you is going to really enjoy them. Again, it's just getting very full of food over in here and I don't really know what to do about it. Mm. Uh, and then we need hugger fruits. Hey, there we go. And phosphor plots and some hens. So, you know what? You guys can just have the hens. But I might see if the uh, things with mochi have refreshed. So we can do a bit more of this. Oh, I like the colour scheme. Pay comes over into uh, the, the, the backpack on this as well. 20 seconds. I can wait for that long. Right. We need less than 100. I'm sure we can do that. Let's just get some spark shot. Get it all together. And grab whatever this is going to be. Slow field, thunderclap, whatever it is. Slow field. Oh, yeah, that'll do the trick. Oh, this just works so perfectly. <laughs> Let's get some more time. Get some more shots. Oh. It almost feels like cheating. <laughs> Shit. Out of ammo. Right, static clinger, go. Oh, perfect shot on that. Yes. <laughs> oh, God, I've only got, like, ten seconds left. Shit. Come on. I mean, I think I might have enough. I just want to be sure. I want to get, like, a hundred. Just to be on the safe side. Oh. Did I manage it? I got 98. That's probably enough. Let's find out. Ugh, got it. <laughs> what the? You collected how many? Well, then I suppose the deluxe coop is now available to you. I would say good luck managing all those chickens, but honestly, you seem to know how to handle yourself. Handle yourself. Little bit of respect from Mochi, I believe. You know, sometimes I feel like this whole planet is a coop. Just a pen to keep people far away. Sometimes I feel like my dad didn't send me out here for a special assignment at all. Sometimes... Sometimes I feel like I was sent out here to stay out of his way. Just a chicken in a coop. Mm. So speaking of chickens, what's a bird brain like you doing hanging around when there's so much work to do? Let's get back to the task at hand. Get me another batch of Quicksilver plots, and I'll give you a very special reward. Access to this manor and its plots. Ooh. My manor would be the one ranch expansion you'll, you have that isn't embarrassing. Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> You're a cheeky bitch, you are, but... Damn. 700 Quicksilver plots to get access to the manor. So we'd be able to breach this force field and head down into this space. Ooh. Now that would be cool. But right, okay. First off, let's have a look at... I'm going I'm to go find an empty plot that I can have a look at so I can figure out what to do about this deluxe kit... I was going to say kitchen coop again. Chicken coop. Okay. Do I have to go to an existing chicken coop to upgrade it? Deluxe upgrade. There we are. Uh, doubles the number of chickens you can keep and moves elders out. Ooh. Oh, nice. So it's got like a plot collector on it that 
or claw collector style thing. I give some fucking chicken TV as well. That's just amazing. All right, we're gonna stick that onto both of these. So, yep, I think that's gonna do it. It's gonna be very good for us. Well, we haven't got any more upgrades to do there. Um, oh damn! You've just seen all the nice stonework that we've got on these steps. Very nice. All right, let's get the arch upgrade as well then. Oh, and then there's some more uh, chroma packs to get. Right, where's which was the arch? I don't think it was that. I think it's probably the arch. Oh, is it these? Ooh, getting a big funky gate as well. Damn, this place is looking good and proper now. It's looking fantastic. I'm so happy with this. Well, yeah, I think that has been a bloody phenomenal uh, way to go about doing some stuff in this episode. Um, I'll probably go off camera, like, getting some more uh, money aside and seeing how things go. I don't think I'm going to, like, I'm not going to do anything too serious when I'm off camera on this sort of stuff. Like, I'm not going to go diving into all the... I might do some of the Quicksilver plot stuff, but I'm not going to, like, hit the limit. I'm not going to go for the full 700, but I might get as close so that I'm not having to spend so much time on camera doing that sort of stuff. But, I mean, we'll see how things go. Um, I will be looking to try and uh, get some more new bucks together. But, uh, yeah, we'll see see how it goes. And next episode, I don't know, we might go and take this slime key and open up a new door, get ourselves into a new area. I'm looking forward to seeing more of the, ra uh, more of the range, see what there is out there. But for now, I'm going to wrap this video up here and just say thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out the playlist on the channel for more Let's Plays or Metal Covers, and give this video a like or a comment just to leave your thoughts. And if you wish to join the ever-growing ranks of the Order of the Shield, subscribe on YouTube, check me follow over on Twitch, or maybe even consider checking out my Patreon and becoming an officer within the ranks. But thank you again for watching this video, and I will catch you all very, very soon. This is Captain Meat Shield, signing off. I change this again. I feel like something's broken. There we go, fixed it. <laughs>